For a hundred years, the Detroit Superior, or Veterans Memorial Bridge, as it's now known, has served the dual function of people mover and people pleaser, a living piece of art and architecture, history and highway that has been the backdrop of so many photo ops over the last century. The city it framed has changed in that time, but this bridge has remained a constant. When it was completed in 1918, it was the first fixed high-level bridge in the city and one of the largest steel and concrete reinforced bridges in the world. And by 1930, it was one of the busiest bridges in the world. Arguably one of the most classic features of the bridge is the one that remains hidden in plain sight. That would be the lower deck, the former subway that used to carry trolley cars across the Cuyahoga River. It's that feature especially that you will be able to check out for your cell phone Saturday as the bridge will be opened as part of the county's centennial celebration of the span. From 10 to 6, the public will be able to experience the subway through self-guided tours. Take a particular note of the catacomb-like feel the bridge offers at its ends and the panoramic views of the city it provides across the river. As in an era when modern bridges seem to open with an expiration date already stamped in place, there are a few built to stand the test of time. Cleveland's lucky to have one of them. For the E-Team, I'm John Kasich.